Well, mine, just that, you know, there's a, there was a lot of stupid uh, things that used to happen on stage, but I remember one tour, I think it was a Head Games tour, and we, uh, we had like a hydraulic lift for us to come out at the beginning of the show in with a lot of all the dry ice and everything. And invariably, the lift would not work properly. And there we go, you know, the whole terrain and everything. <coughs> and we, we get, we'd be coming up, and then it stop, like just here. <laughs> <laughs> so all the audience saw was like heads. Plus six heads <laughs> and us clambering out of this lift, you know. Out of this, uh... But it was the Head Games tour. It was. There the you go. Right, right, right. So it. I... <laughs> How artistic. <laughs> Mine, mine usually have to do with uh, mine usually have to do with uh, falling or bodily functions. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I'm sure you guys are familiar, but uh, let's keep it to the falling. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, the latest one we filmed this uh, we filmed this DVD live at the Ryman, and we were uh, filming the show. We we're on the last song. We we're on Jukebox Hero, and I'm and I'm supposed to jump off the riser as as the band comes in at the top of the song. And I'm thinking to myself, okay, we're filming, so I want to do a little bit extra. A little bit extra, so I jumped a little bit higher than usual and completely went flat on my ass and the microphone flew out of my hand and went into the audience. <laughs> so, nothing, band's playing and nothing's happening. Someone hands me the microphone back, so we eventually have to wait until the end of the show. The audience clears out and we have to cut the front of the song again and splice it in to the, uh, to the, to the video. So if you see it uh, uh, um, on the beginning of the song, I, I don't have any scuff on my knee, and then when the song starts playing, I have the scuff on my knee for the rest of the <laughs> yeah. So, but the body part ones are, body function ones are much funnier. There was a, um, it was at a convention in Las, uh, in Las Vegas for, uh, for buyers, and we had, our manager said, you should go play this. Uh, it was not long after you joined the band, mm -hmm. and, uh, so I had these leather pants, and um, you know, I'm, I'm doing all my, you know, doing, you know, you know, you know all this kind of stuff like that. Fans are right up against the yeah. thing, you know, yeah, and, you know, all these, these poses and stuff like that. And I saw this pregnant lady right down front, kind of <laughs> looking at me like, and she finally went. <laughs> <laughs> The whole crotch was ripped out, and I didn't well, didn't wear underwear that day. And I was like, "Ah, oh, shit! <laughs> sorry, I'm so sorry." She was like, oh, "Now, did yeah. you change your pants, or did you?" Gaffer's tape, right? Yeah, I guess mm -hmm. gaffer's gaffer tape. tape. Yeah, yeah. I, I went over to the side. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't continue to making those same poses. I made that mistake wearing satin pants once. Cause, oh. You know, satin pants don't give. Yeah. And I thought it was cool. I'd wear these new satin pants I had, and. Same thing. Yeah. yeah, that was not. Yeah, you always wanted to have more exposure, but oh. <laughs> and you not knowing—that's the great part. Oh yeah, I didn't, she, she just been. She'd had that look for a while. I'm like, What's wrong with your problem? She's like, I'm already pregnant. I don't need that. <laughs> I don't need to say that ever.